This is the Airbus A220-300, the largest and longest range aircraft of the A220 series. Originally the Bombardier C series, the A220 is a family of narrow-body, twin-engine, medium-range jet airliners, and the development was a bold step for the company. A Canadian manufacturer primarily known for regional jets and turboprop aircraft. The program was officially launched in 2008, aiming to fill the gap in the 100 to 150 seat market segment, challenging the duopoly of Airbus and Boeing. The C-Series was designed with a focus on efficiency and passenger comfort, featuring advanced aerodynamics, materials, and geared turbofan engines. These innovations allowed for significant reductions in fuel use and noise, setting new standards in the segment. The CS300 was particularly notable for offering a longer fuselage and higher passenger capacity while maintaining the series' hallmark efficiency and performance, and quickly garnered attention for its lower operating costs and modern cabin design, making it attractive for airlines looking to replace older, less efficient regional jets or to open new routes that did not warrant larger, narrow-body aircraft. Despite its technological advancements, the C-Series faced significant commercial challenges, including production delays, cost overruns, and stiff competition. In a strategic move, Airbus acquired a majority stake in the C-Series program in 2018, rebranding it as the A220. This acquisition provided the necessary financial and marketing muscle to boost the program. Since then, the A22300 has enjoyed increasing popularity. It has been praised for its performance, efficiency, and passenger comfort, becoming a key player in the 100 to 150 seat market segment. But how good is it actually? Stay with us till the end of the video because here is everything you need to know about the Airbus A22300. Stepping inside, the aircraft boasts a cabin width of 10 feet 7 inches or 3.28 meters, which is wider than most regional jets in its class, and a cabin height of 6 feet 10 inches or 2.08 meters that provides a spacious feel. This generous cabin size allows airlines to configure the A22300 in a variety of layouts, typically accommodating between 130 to 160 passengers depending on the airline's preference for seat configuration and pitch. The overhead bins are a standout feature. These bins are larger compared to other aircraft in the same category and are designed to accommodate larger carry-on bags, allowing passengers to store their luggage wheels first instead of sideways. This design significantly enhances the storage efficiency, enabling more passengers to store their carry-ons on board and reducing the need for gate-checking bags. Seat dimensions and pitch vary by airline, but the standard economy seat is approximately 18 inches or 45 centimeters wide, providing more room compared to many other narrow-body aircraft, and the pitch typically ranges from 30 to 32 inches or 76 to 81 centimeters. This space is adequate for most passengers, offering a comfortable travel experience even on longer flights. The seats are also ergonomically designed, with adjustable headrests and ample cushioning. In-flight entertainment and connectivity options are usually very good. Most airlines equip their A220s with personal seatback screens, offering a wide range of movies, TV shows, games and music, and the system is generally intuitive and responsive. Furthermore, the aircraft is often equipped with Wi-Fi connectivity allowing passengers to stay connected during their flight, although the speed and cost may vary depending on the airline. The cabin lighting deserves a special mention. The aircraft is equipped with LED ambient lighting, which can be adjusted to create a relaxing atmosphere and help minimize jet lag by simulating natural daylight patterns, a feature that is particularly beneficial on longer flights crossing multiple time zones. Regarding noise and vibration levels, the A22300 excels due to its advanced aerodynamics and engines, which are not only fuel efficient but also significantly quieter compared to older regional jet engines, resulting in a more peaceful and comfortable cabin environment. The pressurization and air circulation systems are also noteworthy. The aircraft is equipped with an advanced air management system, 
that provides a lower cabin altitude and better humidity levels compared to many other aircraft, which helps in reducing passenger fatigue and the effects of jet lag. Lastly, the lavatories are designed with passenger comfort in mind. They are more spacious than what you'd typically find in regional jets with improved accessibility features. They also incorporate touchless features and are equipped with efficient ventilation systems, ensuring a clean and pleasant environment. Now let's step into the cockpit. The A22300 features a clean, uncluttered layout with an emphasis on reducing pilot workload and enhancing situational awareness. One of the first things you notice upon entering the cockpit is the wide field of view provided by the large cockpit windows, which not only aids in taxiing, takeoff and landing, but also enhances the overall flying experience for pilots. Central to the avionics suite is the Rockwell Collins Proline Fusion System, an advanced avionics package that integrates multiple functions and displays, ensuring pilots have easy access to all necessary flight information. The suite includes five large, high-resolution, 15.1-inch LCD screens. The EFIS is noteworthy for its clarity and intuitive presentation of flight data. The PFD and ND are well laid out, providing critical information such as attitude, airspeed, altitude, and navigation data in an easily digestible format. The MFD presents comprehensive information about the aircraft's systems, including fuel, hydraulics, and electrical systems, allowing for effective monitoring and management. Flight management is facilitated by a state-of-the-art flight management system, which integrates with the aircraft's autopilot and autothrottle systems. The FMS is user-friendly and highly intuitive, supporting lateral and vertical guidance, performance calculations, and efficient route management. The system's ability to compute and suggest optimal flight paths contribute significantly to fuel efficiency and reduced emissions. One of the standout features in the cockpit is the head-up display. The HUD projects critical flight information onto a transparent display in the pilot's line of sight, allowing for continuous monitoring of flight data without the need to look down at the instrument panel, which is particularly beneficial during critical phases of flight, like takeoff and landing, especially in challenging weather conditions. The aircraft is also equipped with an advanced fly-by-wire system, which replaces conventional manual flight controls with an electronic interface. The FBW system provides flight envelope protection, ensuring the aircraft operates within safe parameters and also makes flying more straightforward and smoother as the system automatically adjusts control surfaces for optimal performance. Communication and navigation are enhanced by the inclusion of modern radios and navigation aids, including VHF and HF radios, GPS, and an IRS. The aircraft also features advanced surveillance systems like ADS-B and TCAS, which improve situational awareness and safety. And finally, the A22300 is equipped with state-of-the-art weather radar and other sensors for enhanced situational awareness. The weather radar provides real-time weather information, aiding in strategic planning and turbulence avoidance. Additionally, the aircraft is fitted with predictive wind shear systems, enhancing safety during takeoff and landing in adverse weather conditions. Now, let's talk about the engine, performance specifications, and how it flies. The Airbus A22300 is powered by Pratt and Whitney PW1500G engines which are part of the revolutionary pure power geared turbofan family, representing a significant advancement in jet propulsion technology. The key innovation in the GTF design is the introduction of a gear system that allows the engine's fan to operate at a different speed than the low pressure compressor and turbine. This innovation leads to a more efficient engine operation with reduced fuel consumption and emissions. Each engine delivers a thrust range of up to 23,300 pounds force. The aircraft requires 6,200 feet or 1,900 meters of runway to take off at sea level on a standard day, with a maximum takeoff weight of 156,000 pounds or 71,000 kilograms and a maximum payload capacity of 41,200 pounds or 18,700 kilograms. The engines allow a maximum rate of climb per minute of 2,500 feet 
or 760 meters, and a maximum cruising altitude of 41,000 feet, or 12,500 meters. The plane has a maximum speed of Mach 0.82, a maximum cruise speed of Mach 0.78, a maximum range of 3,600 nautical miles, which is 4,100 miles or 6,700 kilometers, and a minimum landing distance of 5,000 feet or 1,530 meters. And finally, the base purchase price for a new Airbus A22300 is $91.5 million before options. Thank you for staying with us till the end. Here are two videos you can watch next. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thank